okay, floating. I'm not sure what to call it, but it's like so when you're in the air and you're not diving. And... You can... Generally, you like, I, like you want to, you want to be diving, but sometimes you, uh, it's, there's a few scenarios where it's not necessarily optimal. And in those scenarios, uh, basically, when what you want to do is, if you're boosting, just hold A and nothing else. And if you're not boosting, uh, let go of A and strafe. For some reason, when you strafe, you you'll move a little faster if you're in the air. So, uh, the main example you'll see of uh, this is at Aerodive. Where there will be a big side attack dive. And then you pull back and float. Gallant is uh, better at the floating bit, but... Uh, basically, you're, you'll, uh, go, you'll move, you'll lose less speed if you're MTing while, like, uh, floating, and you'll go a little faster if you hold straight. And when you're using, uh, Fat Shark specifically here for, like, non-side attack or if you just prefer the vehicle, uh, you'll want to hold A until the very end of the boost. Uh, so you'll get a boost here, and you, you'll want to hold A, and then right when the boost ends, that's when you'll want to start the dive, and you'll be able to do this part quite a bit faster than you would if you just dived instantly. Uh, there's, I actually have graphs on this, too. Let's see. Yeah. So this, this blue line is holding the A button. Uh, while floating, and this red button is holding the A button and strafing. So if you're holding, like, when you're holding it, that's, like, not good. It's crap. And this is, uh, during the float, and this is when you're not boosting. Uh, the yellow line is just emptying, so you're not pressing anything, and the green line is, uh, you're not emptying and strafing. So, you you'll just move a little bit faster if you're doing that. I'm not entirely sure why, if it might just be, like, vector analysis with like trig trigonometry shit or if there's some forward aspect to strafing whatever the case is it's uh when you're floating in the air uh and you're not boosting you you want to strafe an mt and then there's all sorts of data i got here but the only the thing to pay attention to is that the fastest uh what's best if you're hit like if you're boosting and floating is that you want to hold A and nothing else uh, while you're floating and then once you're done, like the boost is ended, you either dive or MT and strafe. And that's what this line is and it's what's the best. The rest of these you can kind of ignore because they're slower overall. Create this line here, which is, is the fastest. Yeah. Huh. 